question that you what is wrong with you? Huh? What is wrong with you? Why will you send Ihuoma out of this palace knowing fully well that I gave an instruction that she should not be disturbed? Why? She's been working all day. You people want to kill that girl. Why would you do that? Are you talking to me? Excuse me. Excuse me. I'll slap you. Eh? Don't joke with me. I'll slap you. Eh? I will slap you. Answer me. Why, why, why would you do that? You want to slap me because of that slave girl? Oh, so it's true you're falling for her already. No, you want to beat me up, your sister, because of that nobody. You'll be acting like you're not interested in her. Well, that's deep down, you're dying for her already. What is going on here? What is it? Mother, your son wants to beat me up because of that slave thing we brought in this palace. Can you imagine? Do not call her a slave again. You'll piss me off. Enough. You want to beat her in my presence? What has come over you? Talk to your daughter, all right? I'm older than her and she should respect me. I, I, I gave an instruction that that girl Ihoma should not be disturbed. She has been working since morning. People want to kill her. Yet she sent Ihoma out of this palace. Really? What is the work of Ihoma in this palace? Is she not a slave? Of all the maidens in this kingdom, is a slave that your son, a royal crown prince, is falling for? Mother, I'll beat this girl. You can do I will. Dance. I'll beat her. Enough. Enough of this nonsense. Have you thought of the implications of what you're just doing should in case your father walks in and meets you? What is it? People should stop, please. Come now, please. This thing is spinning me. Now, wow. Eh? I wonder who let that mad dog to be attacking people. Oh. Eh? This is wickedness. Please, brother Kimis. I can't spend more than five minutes here. I have to rush back to the palace, else the princess will kill me. See, this is dog bite. Oh. You need to be patient so that I will attend to you immediately. Oh, yeah, now, do now. Hey. Oh, but the problem is I don't have money. The only money I had with me was the 3,000 naira the princess asked me to buy recharge card with. But unfortunately, I lost it when the dog was pursuing me. I don't have, a, don't See, have any money with me. See, I understand. Ah. And I know the princess will understand. I mean, who, who wouldn't understand what happened to you? And why you need to be treated as soon as possible? Brother Chemist, I said I don't have shishi. You don't understand. Okay, don't worry. I will do the treatment, then you pay later. Uh, okay, thank you. But this treatment, how long do you think it's going to take? Just 10 to 15 minutes, I'm done. Hey, I'm back for Chimo. I'll lose my job. I cannot wait. I've exhausted the time allocated for me for this therapy. No, I'll lose my job. So you need to be treated. This is a dog bite. No. Thank you. I'll come back later. See, will you come back? Can I? Uh, now that your father is here, it's about time I asked you a question. Are you in any way interested in that slave girl? The girl that lives with us here as our maid. Which maid is that, if I may ask? Ihoma, of course. Do I have to answer that? Because I don't know where the question is coming from. I don't even see the relevance of the question. Well, a respectful child always answer every question thrown at him by his parents, not respond with questions. Answer it! I will descend on this girl. <laughs> Father, mother, I will descend on her. Father, can you hear him? <laughs> Did you hear that? You can see he's threatening me before you. Are you not going to say anything? I don't even know why we are discussing about a common slave girl. Did you hear that, Kanayo? Look what you're making all of us do, Kanayo. No, look at it. Sitting down here, discussing about an absolute nobody. I mean, a common slave. You should do better. No, you should do better. Uh, keep quiet. I don't even know why we are discussing about this issue. When we have every other important issues to discuss. For instance, I have an annual general meeting to attend by 10 o'clock. Can I? You go and represent me in that meeting. Everything about the meeting has been put in my email. I will transfer it to you 
and you go and represent me. Very clever. Yeah. I mean, it's, it will always be an honor to represent you in any meeting. But before I leave, Father, I'd like to point out something. The wickedness that has been meted out to that poor, innocent girl is too much. I mean, mother and my sister here, Sinachi, they treat that girl like she's, like she's nothing, like she's a piece of rag. For God's sake, it's wrong. We're all human beings, all right? Yes, we're royalty, but we're human beings. She's also a human being. We should treat, you know, our fellow human beings with love and respect and compassion. And for the last time, if I may ask, why do you care so much about a nobody? I mean, about a slave. Eh? Why does her life matter so much to you? If you are not interested in her, of all the maidens in this king. Usinachi. No, father, ask this, ask your son. No, Usinachi, listen to me. You have to talk to your brother with respect. He is your senior brother and the crown prince of this community. Can I? It's not everything you respond to. After all, she's a girl. You are the crown prince of this community. This life is full of us. No one is too little to be ignored. And you need never fool. So bring back the equality. Abolish the slavery and segregation. My never fool. Stop the discrimination and let to love for me. your leg has the princess asked of me uh, yes like five minutes ago oh god i'm finished i'm dead why are you limping what happened to you i was beaten by a dog eh? yes guinea a dog hey I'm shouting now why are you shouting? Nene, let me tell you they say that anybody beaten by a dog if you don't go to a herbalist or a doctor the next thing you start barking. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop, this is not funny. You know everything in this palace. You know the way they treat me now. Eh? I'm scared. This thing sounds like co comedy. Does it sound like comedy to you? Shut Yeah, let me go and get face aid for you. Go, 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 go. Let me give you face aid. You want Hey! Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Let me get something. Face aid, face aid, face aid. Okay. Now, kneel properly. <laughs> Sorry, ma. Oh! Jesus. <sighs> I gave you 10 minutes to just get me a recharge card. You wasted a whole 24 minutes. I mean, 24 minutes gone just like that. Because of you. Why are you so annoying? No. Why are you so annoying? Do you realize that your presence in this palace irritates the hell out of me? Do you? I'm sorry, my princess. Biko, I'm sorry. That sorry kill you there. In fact, let serious thunder scatter that selling out of yours. I asked you to get me recharge card. You are telling me sorry. Really? Why are you still existing? You know you ought to have died, right? You ought to have died a long time ago. And save all of us from this stress you are subjecting all of us to. You know, right? Where is the recharge card I asked you to get for me? My princess, um, your, your majesty, sorry. Where is my card? My princess, hey, my princess, um, when I was, sorry. Sorry. Where is my card? Um, my princess, when I was going to buy the card, one mad dog attacked me. This dog came after my life. I had to run for my dear life. It's okay. 
even though he ended up biting me. Ah, and what am I supposed to do with this silly excuse of yours? No, what exactly is my business with you being beaten by a dog and losing your dear life? You're talking about your dear life like as if your life is meaningful. Your life is as good as useless, just like you. Just like your presence in this palace. Okay. So, in a nutshell, you didn't buy the recharge card, right? Yes. Can I have my money then? My princess, so quiver, I can't so booty. I'm sorry, my princess, let me explain to you. You know, when the dog came after my life, I, I had to run for my dear life, and when I was running, I lost the money. I didn't know. Yes, I've not even cheated my leg. I said, let me quickly <laughs> rush home and tell you. Shut up! Shut up! Just stop talking. You said you lost my money. The 3,000 Naira I gave you to get me recharge card just because my bank app wasn't working. Right? Now start clapping for yourself. Clap for yourself, idiot! Sorry. Sorry. I'm a wrong one. Mine was a mistake. Beautiful. Beautiful. Forgive me, please. Yeah, Lord. I'm sorry. You see how they provoke your daughter? I'm sorry. And when I begin to react, I'm sorry. They go about calling me all sorts of names. Sorry. I'm wicked. No, you're not. Evil. Also. No. Heartless princess. Whereas, they are always looking for my trouble, always coming for me. You lost a whole 3,000 naira. Just because you were running after your useless life. Why didn't you wait for the dog to finish you up? Because what is the what what are you still existing for? Now I'm talking to you right now. Sorry. What are you still existing for? My princess Ringa is spending me because it was a mistake. Now listen to me. Because of this nonsense thing you've done. I promise you will not eat in this house Sorry. going forward till I approve of it. I will make sure you starve to death. Leave my presence. Sorry. Sorry. Get out! Sorry. This life is full of us. No one is too little to be ignored. I need me never fall. So bring back ah! equality. Abolish ah! the slavery and segregation. Makanini never fool. We are one now. We are one now. Anini never fool. We are one now. We are one now. We are one now. Anini never fool. We are one now. Let's stop the segregation Let's stop the discrimination And let's love My love, you don't seem to be happy You know I hate it when you blame it on me that I'm not being a good mother to my children You know I don't like it <laughs> But it's the truth You're saying it again are you saying you don't know about the growing animosity between your son and your daughter? And what have you done to correct it? How is it my fault that your son has refused to reason with his brains? Rather, he's buttocks. He's constantly having problems with his sister. Especially when it has to do with that slave girl. <laughs> Who is talking about the slave girl here? If you are doing your job, responsibly as a mother. Nobody will think about the slave girl. Nobody. Huh? I mean, call them and advise them so that there won't be hatred in their life. I have never seen where the crown prince and the princess are at each other's throat. Except in my household. Why don't you talk to your son yourself? Than blaming everything on me. You know they are adults. And you know how difficult it is to talk to them. Yes, I know they are adults, but they are children. No matter how big they are, they are still your children. 
You need to bring them, talk to them, and make them realize their mistakes. I will do my own as their father, but the bulk falls on you as their mother. angry and displeased with your parents and sisters method but do you think this plan will go down well with them oh well, at this point i really don't care if it goes down well with them that's their problem i will take that decision and anything that happens let it happen but i'll do it hmm. Mom just walked in now. Okay, she will hear. Mom, Stanley is saying hi. I heard you sent the... I'll call you back. I heard you sent the guards to punish the slave girl. Yes, Mom. Do you know what she did? That was too extreme. You shouldn't have sent them to do that without my consent. What if they had killed her? Then she would die. What? She dies, Mom. Yeah. And everybody will be okay. Because her existence here is as good as useless. And that's useless in capital letter. Wait a minute, mom. Are you actually here to solicit for her? I don't have to solicit for her to know that you went overboard. Your father will not be pleased to hear this. You are a royal princess. You are not supposed to order the guards to punish anyone. It's against the tradition. What if the guards report you to your father and the entire cabinet? What becomes of you? Excellent, Mom. Exactly what I'm looking for. Hey, I do not care at all. They should go ahead and report me to whoever they want to. All right? I'm fine. No, I, I need to understand this. What is actually going on here? When does the life of a common slave become more important than the life of a royal princess? I'm royalty, Mom. What's oh, the Stop! Stop it! My child, I am not against you sending anyone on an errand or chores. I am not against you punishing anyone by yourself. 
but involving the guards is totally out of line. Now I want you to promise me that you will never repeat that again. Mother, make the promise. I am listening. I am patiently waiting. Uh, okay, it's, it's fine, Mom. I'm, I'm sorry. I promise I will not ask the guard to beat up any idiot again. Good. You know your father is weak now. I wouldn't want anything to bother him. Okay? Give me a smile. <laughs> look at you. I'll be in my room. I'll come, I'll come look for you later. All right. Ah, Ihoma. We saw what happened. I'm so sorry. It's a pity we have terrible people in this place. Eh? That princess. Hi, Chineke. I'm so sorry, my dear. I'm so sorry, do oh. Hi. Hmm. That princess is so wicked. Her heart is full of wickedness. To see her. Huh. But I don't know why you girls are speaking as if you don't know what is going on in this community. Eh? It's because Ihoma here is an outcast. Osu? Ha! You know Osu people have never been treated nicely, wherever they are. Even in this community. Because they don't behave like us now, eh, man? And what makes us better than them? Eh? No, tell me now. Ioma here is very intelligent, eh? And she has saved us in a million ways since we started working here, eh? So, like, I don't get it. Keiho, eh? She is smart and always ready to help. So, tell me, how are we better than Osu people? Gwamia? See, eh, the only problem we have in this palace is that wicked princess. I feel like poisoning her because I hate her so much. I don't like her either. But does it matter? Eh? She is still the princess with high authority. We have no choice but to obey her. I was bitten by a dog. Eh? Hey! You need to go see a doctor immediately. Eh? Or a chemist. Eh? I will talk to the queen to give you permission to go get yourself treated. Ha! Maki ha ba ya kwane ho ozo. It's very important to. Must hey. talk to the queen. Okay, Let's just pass. cover her up so that she will go and treat herself very good. Queen, queen, queen. queen. For me, well, my leg hurts. I need to get myself treated right away. Please, my leg hurts. Uh, did you collect permission? The other maiden said they will cover for me. Please do yeah. fast, do fast. Hey, 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 hey! Oh. You silly bastard! And what exactly do you think you're doing? My princess, uh, as you can see, yes. she has some injury here. Yes. She wants to go to the chemist and take care of herself. You must be very mad for standing there and speak to me about her taking care of herself. With such boldness, how dare you? The princess, please, sorry. Don't be offended. My leg hurts. I just want to get to the chemist shop and get it treated. It's paining me, please. Idiot. <coughs> now listen to me. Forever daring to thwart my orders in this palace, I will have you punished. You spawn of a wretched witch. And as for you, listen to me. Look at me. I forbid you from leaving this palace in the next seven days. And any attempt whatsoever to thwart my order, I will have your head chopped off. Now, leave. Immediately. life. 
is fall of us. No one is too little to be ignored. And you need never fail. So bring back the quality. Abolish the slavery and segregation. My never fail. I need never food. Thank you so much, my dear Uzamaka. I really appreciate this. Anything for you, my princess. Anything at all. Hmm. <laughs> Uzamaka, if you continue like this, I shall make you my personal maiden. And that means you will benefit a whole lot from me. Wow, my princess. Thank you so much, my princess. Thank you. I can't wait for that day. One more thing. I will need you to report every of her steps, plan and actions to me. Okay? Of course, my princess. I will do that. Thank you. Thank you so much, my princess. <laughs> And as for the other maidens, <laughs> their punishment awaits them. And it's going to come like a bang. Thank you so much, my princess. <laughs> you can go. Okay. Welcome, my prince. Uh, how are you? I'm fine, sir. Um, my prince, please. There is something I want to passionately and politely appeal to you. Go ahead. My, my prince is about that slave girl, Limoma. Okay, what about her? Um, sir, please. Is there a way you can just send her out of this palace? Please. Because if you leave her here one day, maybe the princess or the queen might kill her. One of these days, they might kill her. Did anything happen to her when I left? I told you girls it was a bad idea for she to leave this palace without seeking permission from the queen or the princess. But you never listened to me, Mwanenia. But the queen used to take her siesta by that time. So someone must have told her about it. Someone like who? In Aju. You, Zamaka, you already know who she's talking about. You already know. Onya Asere. Asere Amaka. Wait, what is that supposed to mean? Amaka. Are you accusing me in any way? I am not accusing you, Uzamaka. You already know the truth. Which you know the truth. What truth, are you Ima Chakwa. what truth are you talking about? What stupid truth are you talking about? Eh? Okay, do you have any proof that I'm the one that told the princess what you are saying? It will prove. Now, you're not saying anything. Can you imagine? I don't even want to know who told the princess about it. But the person is evil. I will meet such fate worse than that of Iwoma. Iafun. I don't know why you girls are advocating for Iwoma. Eh? She knows her life is doomed from birth. See, let me tell you. Even if she leaves this community to another, her background will still follow her and it will be a hindrance to whatever she ventures into. Enania, I don't understand all this pity, party, fake love. I don't understand. You can't change it. It's in her blood. What are we talking about? Honestly, Uzamaka, you sound so annoying. 
But I don't blame you. I don't blame you. No, Zugo, Beacon, stop. Please, I don't want you girls to have issues because of me. If you want to support me, it's fine. If you don't want, it's also okay. You don't owe me anything. I know it's not easy for one to associate oneself with an outcast like me. Please. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, Mama. Before us, you are not an outcast. Mm -hmm. You are a human being just like all of us here. Yeah? Mm -hmm. So uh -huh. please stop calling yourself an outcast. Thank you, but I wouldn't want you people to have problems. Biko, let's learn to respect each other's decision and feelings. Mm -hmm. Hi. 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 Can I apply the hot water mm -hmm. now? Yeah. Hey, Hi. 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 Or could it be they have taken her to a better hospital in town? Oh, I just pray they treat that girl before it results to something else. I came there too. I won't buy one medicine. One medicine? Mm. Oh no, come. Wait, now what money they collect? I've been a new one. Okay, will they collect anyone? Come, come. No, they don't. This life is full of us. No one is too little to be ignored. And you need never fool. So bring back the quality. Abolish this. Life. No way! No way! She's an outcast and can never be part of this family. That's some period. It's very simple. Send her out of the palace instead of torturing her to death. Send her away. My son. I was told that you went late to the annual general meeting. But you made a good presentation, so I'm proud of you. Thank you very much, Father. Of course, I'll always make very good presentations anytime I go to represent you. I'm a very intelligent young man just like you. But permit me to leave that side. That's not what we're talking about. We have a matter at hand. I mean, the way this girl is being treated, it is wrong. It's wrong. If people don't like the girl, let her leave. Do you want to kill her? For God's sake, she's a human being. If you don't want her in the palace, let her go. It's, it's wrong, for God's sake. This is the last time we will discuss about this slave girl in this palace. Fine, I agree with you, Father. To achieve that, let her just go before they kill the girl. Let her leave. No, Father. That girl is a slave and shouldn't be set free just like that. Remember before she was accepted into this palace, she made a vow to stay and complete her years. Uh, we should not set her free just like that. That's what I'm trying to say, Father. In as much as I want that idiot to leave this palace and stop causing more trouble, I agree with Tosinachi here. She has to complete the years she promised to serve this royal household. Mother, it's unfair. This is unfair. How will she complete the years when, when people want to kill her? If she dies, how will she complete the years? For God's sake, there are other maidens in this palace who are more acceptable to you. You say she's, I don't know what you call her, then let her leave. Let her leave. Do with the, the, the other maidens. Let, let them stay here and work. Instead of killing this one, let her go. My son, listen. She will not leave. Oh. She made a vow to serve for 10 years and she has not even completed it. Mm -hmm. So we will retain her here. What I don't want is people coming to me to present one issue or the other concerning the girl, I don't wonder it has to stop. Um, my son, Father. you have to give me a report of the annual general meeting that you attended. Did I make myself clear? Yes, Father. My prince. I heard what happened to you. The gate man told me that my sister ordered the guards to flog you. I'm sorry about it. My prince, you really do not have to bother yourself about me. I'm fine. Thank you, my prince. Uh, honestly, I'm bothered. I'm really bothered. I don't know what's wrong with my sister. She... I just don't know. She... Sometimes I ask myself, what did she take after? Being so wicked, treating people like they're nothing. 
I'm really very sorry. It's okay. It's okay, my prince. No, it's not okay. I'll take you to a hospital. No, my prince, please, no. No, I'm fine. I'm all right. Don't bother. Yoma, you're not fine. I know you're not fine. I'll take you to a hospital. My prince, please. I beg you in the name of God. I'm not even worthy to touch the sole of your shoe, let alone sitting in the same car with you. Please. I'm fine, my prince. It's your go. All right, then. I'll send for a doctor to come here and take care of you. My prince, there will be no need for that. Please, like I said, I'm fine. I'm okay. Are you sure? Yes, my prince. Thank you for your concern. Very sure. Yes, my prince. All right, then, if you say so. <clears throat> but I want you to know that I'm really very concerned about you. Okay? As long as you're in this palace, uh, if there's anything going on, anything happening to you or with you, just let me know. Okay? Yes, I'll make sure your days in this palace will be rosy. Thank you. Yes, thanks. as long as I'm here, as long as I'm alive. I'll also let the maidens know that you should be exempted from today's chores. Yes, you've suffered enough for one day, you need to get some rest. And those guards, uh, I'll deal with them. Hi, my prince, please. Please. They acted under the command of the princess. Spare them, my prince. It's not really their fault. Well, I understand it's not their fault, but I think to a large extent it's also their fault. They should know that uh, they're supposed to take such orders from only me and my father, the king. Please. Not from my sister. Please, spare them. They were instructed to and she was standing there too. They couldn't have disobeyed her, please. Please, I'm pleading on their behalf, my prince. They were instructed to, please. It's alright, it's alright. Thank you so much, my prince. Okay. May your days be long. Dare you barge into my room like that? Apologies, my princess. My princess, you need to see this. Follow me. See bloody what? You need to see this. My princess, come with me. Soon. I honestly feel bad for flogging that helpless kid. How can you feel bad for flogging an outcast? Yes, she's an outcast. But imagine if it was your sister. Onyeka, we are not outcasts. And my sister is not one. Zuna, I know. But I was only giving an instance. You can't use my sister to give an instance. Do you understand? Use your sister instead. Sorry, you. But all I'm saying is that all we did was unfair. And we had the right to refuse such order from the princess. Says who? Onyeka, you and I know that we don't have such right. We do. This is what we do. She's a princess and has limited authority over us. Or have you forgotten that we were warriors before we started guarding the palace? She's not supposed to make us do what we're not supposed to do. Or what is not right? What we did might not be right to you. But you see me, Izuna. You see, that thing we did was perfect. I don't even care about what you're saying or that helpless girl. Izuna. Izuna, one day you will care. I promise you. Show me wickedness, Izuna. Show me it. into my room. Why? I am very ashamed of you. 
What is wrong with you? For God's sake, what is wrong with you? You know, at first I actually thought it was a joke. How demeaning. Can you just make sense or leave my room? Okay. I am talking about that cursed daughter of a nobody called Iyoma or whatever she answers. So of all the beautiful maidens in this kingdom, you chose that nobody. I mean that dirty thing. You know you should have told me your sister that you're ready to settle down and I would gladly introduce you to one or two posh girls at no absolute cost. I see you've lost the respect that you have for me as your elder brother. How dare you? How dare you? Listen to me. I am going straight away to tell our parents before she infects you with her generational curse. I'm ashamed of you, Kanaya. I am ashamed of you. You should do better. You can do better. You should. I'll deal with this girl. This is getting out of hand. I'm going to deal with you one day. Just walk into my room and you talk to me anyhow. I'll deal with you. What is going on between you and my brother? Sorry. You don't want to talk? No, I don't. I will Sorry. match Sorry. you right now. What is going on between you and my brother? Start talking before I slap you. My princess, I don't, I don't understand. Please, sorry, sorry. You don't understand. You don't understand. Sorry, sorry. sorry. There's nothing. I'm going to ask you for the last time, and I need you to give me a straight answer. What is going on? Between you and my, what was it saying to you? Do you want me to slap you? No, no, no. Now, I swear to God, speak. speak. I'm true to God. There's nothing. It's just that he, he he honored me with his presence to check on me. Nothing. There's nothing going on. You mean my brother, a royal crown prince, honored a cursed thing like you? As what? Who? No. Who the hell do you think you are? Nobody. Oh boy. Wait a minute. This thing actually said that my brother, a royal crown prince, honored you. How dare you? Okay. I am going to say this for the last time. The very next time I see you close to my brother, or even as little as saying hello to him, even when he says hi to you, do not respond. If I see you in any close proximity, with my brother ever again, I will use screwdriver and pull out all the teeth in your mouth and feed it to the dogs. Did you hear that? Yes, ma. Now I yes, do not want to repeat myself again. Yes, ma. What's going on is that I'm sick and tired of the wickedness in this palace. Why is that girl being treated like, like she's not a human being? Huh? Let her leave. If you people don't like her, let her leave instead of dehumanizing her. It's wrong. You're interested in her, right? Tell me and I will stop it right here and now. Come on, son. You love her, right? I don't love her, mother. I don't love her. I don't need to love her to know that what you people are doing is wrong. I don't need to love her to protect her. I don't need to love her to tell you people the truth. Stop treating her like she's not a human being. You amaze me. Honestly, I don't know where all these are coming from. I am not understanding it. You have to stop. Stop this unjustified animosity going on between you and your sister. Stop it. Mother, there is no animosity going on between me and my sister. I am her elder brother. She should respect me. And all these are going to stop when she stops smoking whatever she's smoking that is making her insult me. Can you hear me? That's when it will stop. Son, respect is earned. You have to respect yourself first before demanding it from others. Your father is already blaming me for all this. Of course he will blame you. Is he supposed to blame me? Did I give birth to my sister? You gave birth to her. You're the mother. You're supposed to train her. 
You're supposed to teach her to respect her elder brother. You're supposed to teach her to, to, to treat people like, well, you know, you should have sense. I mean, you should be treating people as if they are nothing. But you, you didn't do that. You didn't teach her anything. Really? Yes. Kana, you shouldn't talk to me in that, in that manner. I am still your mother no matter what. Of course I know I will never forget that. I know, but what I'm saying, what I'm saying is clear. This life is full of us. No one is too little to be ignored. And you need never fool. Hey. So bring back the quality. Abolish the slavery and situation. My dear, she's an outcast. Whether the prince wants to accept that or not. Exactly my point. Eh? This is what I have been trying to make Chidema and Amaka understand. But they are both against me. Are you serious? I'm telling you. Eh? Even Onyeka is against me as well. But I don't even care. Do you understand? See, Uzamaka, let us call a spade a spade. That girl is an outcast. A slave who has no place in this kingdom and should be treated with disdain. Me? <laughs> I am tired of trying to make other maidens understand this. I am tired. What I will never support is her relationship with the prince. I will never do that. Yes, and I will keep exposing all her evil plans. As long as I'm still in this, in this palace, it will never work. Uzamaka, are you telling me that that girl has eyes for the prince? See nobody. For the prince, what? Can you imagine? I will personally behead that girl myself. My dear, see eh? I am not even blaming the girl. I blame the prince for all these things. Eh? For stooping so low. Hi, Kai, 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 Kai. The king will be so disappointed if he hear this. Telling you. I am telling you. Eh? Just imagine what a this. fellow he has is, as a son. A slave. On the chair. Have you forgotten you are a queen? You don't have to be moody because of that low life slave girl. No, she doesn't deserve that. Cheer up, okay? I am not in this mood because of that slave girl. But because of your brother, I do not understand him anymore. He speaks to me in whatever tone or manner he deems fit. He doesn't care about how I feel anymore. That's my pain. Honest to God, I, I am really gutted in him. Like, he's just changed drastically. What came over him? See, I know he's not having an affair with that girl. I mean, as much as your brother is behaving funny, he can't stoop that low. I know my son. Because that relationship will never work. <laughs> Mother. I don't think so, because with the current situation right now, you can't just vouch for him anymore. He's capable of doing the unimaginable, all right? So let's not take chances. I suggest we get him hitched immediately. Let's get him a wife. And you know I can do that, right? Come on. It's been confirmed, Ihoma, that Uza Maka is the wicked one in our midst. She has been the one transmitting all the information to the queen or the princess. Mm. Thank you so much for stating the obvious. I know. I know she really wants to find her way into the princess's heart. Let her carry on. I've not offended anybody in this palace, and my god would definitely fight my part. Why do you say we should let her be? Eh? I'm already prepared to beat her up in this palace. Ah, please, you do no such thing. I wouldn't want us to follow this with violence. Please. I'm suggesting we leak her secrets. Eh? Amaka, if you do that, what's the difference between the girl and yourself? Eh? We cannot pay evil with evil. Let's just allow her to do her thing one day. 
all my skills are. Hey, thank you. Don't leak her secret though. Mm -hmm. Do not do that. It's not good. We keep the written that girl. Let's just set her up and send her out of this palace. Mm -hmm. You'll be happy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's not an attribute of a good woman. Oh my princess, I, I I came to check if the room is dirty, so I can clean it for you. You didn't do that in the morning. No, my princess. Listen to me. Let today be the first and the last time you walk into my room without my permission. Did you get that? I am sorry, my princess. It won't happen again. Get out. Should I go? No. Out? Drop the thing you came to. Yeah. Can Lily? Get out! Come back here. And do what? No, and do what? Come, you get me angry. If I'm talking to somebody, don't don't tell the person to leave. Don't try it again. What is wrong with you? What 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 even happened to your leg? I was bitten by a dog. The dog? Yes, my prince. Ah. Wait, wait. Can you see that? you with this nonsense. She just said she was beaten by a dog. Oh, obviously, she, she must have rabies. And she's been going about in this house, spreading it. You are evil this year. Oh my God, I feel like throwing up right now. It's in the dog. Yes. Why didn't you tell me all this while? Wait, 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 wait. Amaka? Chidema? Ah, where are these people now? No, no, wait, don't no worry, don't no worry, I, I know what to do. She didn't matter where, where are they? Amaka! This life is full oh. of us. No one oh. is too little to be in oh. And you need never to So bring back the quality. Oh. Abolish the slavery and segregation. Makanini oh. never fool. I need me never fool Yeah, you will be a one Yeah, one My prince, okay. let me follow you to the hospital and give me assistance All right. Stop the segregation Stop the discrimination And let your love for you Life is full of us. No one is too little to be ignored. And you need never fool. Hey. So bring back the. Sorry, can you... <coughs> How did it happen? Hmm. The madman. 
I was driving, a madman came out from nowhere, jumped into the road. I was trying to avoid, you know, hitting him so I don't hurt him. Hey. I fell into a ditch. But it's okay, I've called a mechanic to take care of the car. As for me, just a little pain in my neck, but I know it's not serious, I'll be fine. You see what I've been saying about that cursed girl? You see what I've been saying? She almost took your life with this accident. Stay out of her. Don't even have anything to do with her. You don't know here. Don't stop this now. Stop this, please. Accidents happen all the time. It has nothing to do with her. Ihoma, she didn't cause it. Besides, she's in the hospital right now fighting for her life. Because that evil daughter you have refused that treatment knowing fully well that she was bitten by a dog. Chirekwa, does Usinachi know about it? Uh, of course she. Uh, my king, it's not about Usinachi knowing about it or not. The problem here is that she kept it to herself. She knew she was bitten by a dog. She refused to tell me about it. Nacho no ga alaputa. Odinma. We, uh, but is she responding to treatment? According to the doctor, yes. But for the, the maltreatment is too much. Please tell them. The maltreatment is too much. 